Hello and welcome to episode 172 of WITM. I hope you're all enjoying your Memorial Day weekend, or at least as much as us retail slaves are allowed to enjoy it. And hopefully I can make even better with some WITM action for you. Now I accidentally simmed the NXT card, so we're not going to count that week. Instead, Andrew will be making his return in the same match he was scheduled on for NXT, so not really missing much. One night before he will defend either the NXT Championship or NXT Tag Team title at NXT TakeOver London, he will tag alongside the man who helped him get his suspension rescinded, encouraging Triple H to take a second look. Austin Aries It's going to be the AA Hardcore Cruisers in non-title action as they're going to take... On Tony Nese and Drew Gulak open lock themselves into a tag title shot at NXT took over London in 24 hours in an elimination tag match. And it's in Andrew's home country, or oh, yeah, obviously Andrew's home country, but home state of Michigan in Detroit, Michigan, in the new Little Caesars Arena, home of his favorite. NHL hockey team, the Detroit Red Wings. So Andrew with the home crowd behind him, trying to build some momentum heading into NXT TakeOver London and WrestleMania. Let's get underway. Buckle up because we have a contest that's going to blow the roof off this place. I hope it's not raining outside. We have a team led by one of the best talents on the roster today versus a formidable opposition to say the least. Two super teams, who's gonna win? Holy loading screen.
All right, so it's going to be Andrew start finally after a two and a half week suspension that has since been rescinded. Andrew can return to WWE action already with as much momentum as he can build up, but looking to build up even to keep that momentum rolling. Heading into in 24 hours, NXT TakeOver London. And in one week, WrestleMania 35, where he will take on his former best friend, now turned rival, Corey, with his NXT future on the line, as well as his NXT trainer's position. Andrew, with a reverse DDT, forces Nice to a seated position, headbutt by Andrew. Kick to the back. Now Andrew, looking to take flight and the springboard splash connects. Andrew feeding off the energy of his home state fans in Detroit, Michigan. Andrew working the head, has the hammer and chin lock locked in. Nice quickly breaks the hold. Thought he was gonna try and tag in Drew Gulak there, but let's not to. Forces Andrew into the corner. Now he will tag in Gulak, and it's gonna be a double team attack. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No and Nice will return to the apron as Gulak stomps on the elbow of Andrew and wants to take flight. And the splash it. connects. And you have to assume his partner is just itching to get in there right about now. I tell you, we knew this was going Gulak to be looking to work the leg, but, but Andrew is going to break the hole, and that's going to give him an opportunity to tag in Austin Aries. These two guys be Andrew getting one last kick in before he returns to the apron. Irish trip into the ropes. Reversal by Gulak. Stomp to the back. Another stomp. Stomp to the elbow. He's going back to an old friend with that one. <laughs> You're right about that. And reversal by Aries. Stomp to the arm. And Gulak attacking the arm of Aries. He's inflicting some serious pain. Now a backbreaker. And again is gonna tag in Tony Nice. Several strikes by Gulak before he returns to the apron. Looks like he's pinpointing the back. Now Aries. He knows his opponent is submission locked in. Look in the head. Locked in pretty well, but Nice is able to break the hold. Forces Aries up. With a variation of Aries' old finishing move, the Brain Buster, and another tag for Nice and Gulak. Frequent tags early on in this match for the team of Tony Nice and Drew Gulak. Aries on the attack, looking to take flight right in front of Nice. We'll see how that turns out, and he will get the maneuver off the diving axe handle, and it will connect. Now he tags in Andrew. Andrew attacking the leg of Gulak. Reversal by Gulak. And a DDT. Missing with the grapple and goes for cover. And Andrew's going to power out at two. Andrew rolls out of the way to avoid the stomp and huge two handed bulldog by Andrew. Goes for cover. And Gulak powers out at one. Now looking for ground elbow strikes, but Gulak is able to turn Andrew over and reverse. Looking for a brain buster, but Andrew knows a thing or two about that move, and he's going to break it up. Andrew forces Gulak into the hardcore cruiser's corner and will tag in Austin Aries, but first a double team attack. Andrew locks in a sharpshooter. And Aries stomps away at the ankles. Now attacking the arm. Aries springboard. Splash connects. 
Reversal by Gulak, who go, immediately goes for cover. And Aries is going to power out almost instantly. Forces Aries to his feet. Reversal by Aries. Side slam. Aries looking for the running clothesline. And that's going to connect. Aries forces Gulak up and a reversal. Gulak raises his arm and taunts the WWE Universe and Aries. Gulak tags in Tony Nese. Kick by Nice. Reversal in the corner. Elbow strike by Aries. Aries thinking last chancery. Last chancery locked in. Goes for a cover. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. They can end it here. What now? Andrew and Nice powers out at two. And two handed bulldog by Nice. Oh, look at the emotion. Andrew can take flight. Man, and axe him. handle by Almost Andrew. Like bell got seriously wrong there. He's showing no signs of letting up. He knows his opponent is completely. Roy knee bar locked in. Will this lead to the first elimination in this match? No, Nice is going to power out. All four men are in the ring now. Nice is going to try to go for a cover. Aries is right there to break it up. Nice trying to taunt. That's going to open up offense for Andrew. Our strip into the corner. Reversal by Nice. Drop kick sends Andrew flying to the outside, and that's going to give a bloody knees opportunity to tag in Drew Gulak. Andrew finally gets up, but Gulak is out there to meet him. This is not a notice qualification match, so if these men stay out here too long, they will be eliminated and will be down to Aries and Nice. Andrew forces Gulak to his feet and attacks the ankle. Andrew makes his way back into the ring and going high risk. Andrew to the top rope. He's going to dive outside onto Drew Gulak. And that's going to connect the frog splash from the top rope to the outside as Andrew stumps away at Gulak. Impressive maneuver by Andrew. Reversal by Gulak. And that huge clothesline is going to connect. Stomp to the back of the head of Andrew. Reversal by Andrew. We're out of six count. Are we going to see one or both of these men eliminated via count out? Gulak was wanting to hit a finisher, but I think he noticed that count and elected not to. Reversal by Andrew.
Andrew looking for a springboard maneuver and decides not to as Gulak already starts getting up to his feet. Cags in Austin Aries. Stomp to the back. Punch to the back. Swinging neck breaker. And now Gulak is like similar to his partner is gonna be busted open as well. Stomp to the back. Drags Gulak's in a ring and goes for cover. Dirty pin. Nearly in our first elimination of this match. But Gulak is able to power out and Andrew, not the legal man, but he was trying to lock in the reverse DDT. Reversal by Gulak. Reversal by Aries. Reversal by Gulak. Gulak forces Aries onto the ropes. Got a reversal by Aries. Our trip into the corner. And a spinning back fist by Aries. Stomp to Gulak. Knee to the hip. Knee to the head. Goes for a cover, but Aries immediately breaks it up. Tags in Tony Nice. Austin Aries is in serious trouble. Is there anything that could be done to get back to him being a threat? If they want to win this match, he really needs to make a tag soon. You said it, and he does not want to let his opponent gain some steam here and start to get the upper hand. I don't know about you guys, but great counter. Reversal He's by Aries. Just look at this man. He's all business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. Aries Boy, biding his time really in the corner. Now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be King, but I still don't see him giving up. Nice. Crawling to his feet. Aries, somewhat stranger, is going to allow him and not keep the attack on. He's simply reminding him. Elbow strikes. Right in the face. Nice neck breaker there by Aries. That's going to. Allow him to set for the running clothesline. But Nice is going to reverse it. Kick by Nice. Elbow trick by Aries. Reversal by Nice. And Tony Nice has been eliminated. Drew Gulak stands alone for his team against both members of the NXT Tag Team Champion Hardcore Cruisers. Reversal by Nice. Forces Aries to his feet. And a variation of another Brain Buster by Gulak and he's looking to take flight. But Aries catches him midair into a backbreaker. Great move there by Aries. Suplex, suplex into a cover by Gulak, but Aries powers out at two. Gulak getting fired up. Stomp to the head of Aries. Reversal by Aries. Goes for cover. And Gulak powers out at two. Elbow strike by Aries. Irish up into the corner. Detroit has had the reputation for being an electric crowd. The fans here in attendance tonight are indeed no different. 
Spinning back fist by Aries goes for cover. And that's going to be a double A hardcore pushers victory. They will keep the momentum rolling heading into NXT TakeOver London. As usual, really knows how to celebrate a victory. But all jokes aside, the momentum keeps on rolling for the Double A Hardcore Cruisers, and they will possibly be defending those NXT Tag Team Titles, or Andrew will defend his NXT Championship at NXT Takeover London. It's now time for a rankings update, which I will do off screen and the end to this episode. So that is going to do it for episode 172 of WITM. Until 173 in NXT TakeOver London, this is Corey, signing off. <laughs>